Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia. Welcome back to another episode of our Wolong Let's Play. So we're in the load screen here once again because we are in a new area. We're in Guangzhou in the Julu Commandery of the Ji Province. This is the hometown commandery for the Zhang brothers and one of their strongholds in the north. Historically speaking, Zhang Nan would retreat here with the army that was launched at the capital after being beaten back. And here is where he will also die. Zhang Jiao will take command of this outpost and die from sickness while being under siege. And then Zhang Bao will eventually escape here after it was taken and he will go to Chuyang where he would maintain some resistance before being taken out as well. So two of the Zhang brothers will die here even though I think we technically killed two already. But we're here hunting for Zhang Jiao, the leader. Now this is a very interesting location that's mentioned here because it's home to the Shaqiu Palace or Shaqiu Gong. It's in ruins today and I don't think it was maintained into the later Han period so it should be in ruins in this period too because it's often considered a cursed palace in Chinese history. It wasn't first built by the King Wu Ling of Zhao during the spring, autumn, and warring state period as mentioned here. It was actually first built by the last king of the Shang Dynasty, Shang Zhou Wang, who is often featured in a lot of mythical tales with his wife Da Ji, who is said to come from a night tail fox demon there to corrupt him and thus ending the Shang Dynasty. He built Sha Tio Palace, and obviously, being the last king of a dynasty, it's cursed. But the curse goes farther than this, because after the fall of the Shang Dynasty, we enter the Zhou Dynasty where we have spring, autumn, and warring state period dividing that dynasty. And King of Zhao, as the kingdom of Zhao falls in this area, Wu Ling, actually renovated this palace. And he was a great man, all things considered. He's the one who adapted the clothing of the Han in the Zhao kingdom to that of the nomads so that they can become better cavalry officers since the traditional Han clothing wasn't really suitable for horseback riding since the clothing are usually really loose and had robes versus the pants and tight clothing of the nomads. And that made Zhao a great kingdom with their cavalry. He was also the first one to start building the great walls. He would go on later in his life to make one bad decision in that he made his second son the heir. And he actually gave the crown to his second son as he would step aside as king. But obviously his firstborn son, the eldest, traditionally the one who should inherit, is very unhappy about this. And the two sons were basically about to fight each other. So as the retired king, he tried to help out the situation by inviting both sons to come vacation with him at his palace in Sha Tio. So he went there with both his sons, and his eldest son took that as an opportunity to rebel. And he will launch an attack at Sha Tio Palace trying to kill the younger son, his younger brother, to get his crown back. Armies from the second son would eventually win out and take Sha Tio Palace, kill the older brother. But then because they killed the son of the retired king, the troops that were in charge of retaking Sha Tio Palace became really worried that King Wu Ling would revenge against them. So they decided that they would surround the palace and starve him there. So they didn't kill him because they didn't want to upset the current king, but they didn't let him leave. And he will live out in that palace for three months before running out of food and water and dying of starvation, essentially. So a very sad end to a rather great king of the Zhao kingdom. And another reason why this palace is cursed, but perhaps the most essential reason which is mentioned here is that the first emperor of Qin, the first emperor of all of China, Qin Shi Huang, would go on to his final tour of the nation when he was 50, and he would die at this palace coming back on his fourth trip. So this is often casted as a very cursed palace where emperors come to die. And if you want to include Zhang Jiao in there, Zhang Jiao also dies of sickness here as well. So this is definitely not a fun place, but should be a pretty grand place for us to fight in. So let's load in here. Now we just did some side missions last time and we're with Sun Jian. Uh, I believe I she's not coming with us. Hong Jin is not coming with us. Sun Jian is coming with us and we can 
Yo, See if we can upgrade anything. Now, we don't have any rank 3 steals. So this is maxed out, but we did get a new weapon last time in the Cavalry Javelin. And we might be interested in upgrading this. Martial art damage increase. Something about vulnerability on enemy upon using martial arts. Deflect spirit consumption. Spirit. Spirit vulnerability. Okay. I feel like this is a pretty decent offhand weapon for us. So let's upgrade this twice. We can afford that. We'll replace our dual bronze sword now that we're no longer cosplaying as Nobe either. Let's just upgrade it twice. We'll use our rank 2 steel on it since these are our only two four star weapons to speak of. We still have plenty of empty item slots, so we don't have to worry too much about that. We did get quite a few gear from those side battlefield or sub battlefield, I guess that they're called. I'm trying to see if there's anything that we would want to replace what we're currently wearing. Now we did get a four star item as well. At the time I thought it was our only four star. I think we got one in the first stage as well, right before the boss fight. Yeah, we got the champion helmet in that first stage. Doesn't really suit us, so we're not gonna use that. I'm gonna sort it by, by rarity. We have a lot of gear, we should sell Maybe even some of the two-star one. I'm still holding out hope for salvage. Wait, I'm pretty sure we got a... Right here, we got the bracer. We put it on, right? That's what happened. Pretty happy uh, Pretty happy overall with our build, so we don't have to do much there. All right, Sun Jian, let's go. Let's clear this stage. We have a secret path behind enemy line, thanks to our... Scouting, or technically we follow Jung Ball here as he escaped. Should we... Let's try out our spear. Is this really... Is this really a... A skilled troop. He had zero point of morale rank. <laughs> Alright, I see an archer up front. I can't cast any of our spells because we don't have any morale rank to cast them, so no sneaking up using invisibility. I know there's a guy here. Is he going to turn around? No, he went up. He's going to come down, though. All right, we can wait till he walks out and then we stab him from the back. He's not going to see us over there. There he is. Never mind, not an archer holding a... A staff. Pretty sure I saw Archer though. There's Archer there on the cliff, but is there not an Archer down here? Guess not. Alright, there's no loot here. We should be good. There is a diversion path. Alright, I see him. Does he peek? He does. There is a warlock up there. 
I don't know if he gets activated when we show or not. Let's me break these crates in case there's a loot. Nope, don't see any glow. Pulley didn't have anything. We can sneak up and kill the warlock first. Yep. They only listen for footsteps. Breaking item doesn't alert them. He's facing this way, so I guess we do want to approach him from the back. Oh, he's using Twin Z as well. Are there anything to his... Yeah, there's a path over here too. But let's grab that loot while we see it. We should have a lot of stuff in our storage. Seems to be just a flag. Yeah. We could use this. We have enough point for one more tier. Let's get another water virtue. I want the ranged weapon to do more damage as well. Is that a chest up there? No. Ooh, it's a nice juggle for the second martial art move. Wait, there's something here. He's hiding behind the... Sneaky! Anti-freeze soil. That's new. Mysterious soil that has been able to, uh, ability to ward off damage from cold. So, similar to our heatproof ice. Still getting rank 2 gear. Okay, so this is one of those lieutenants with the cursed flag. He has a couple soldiers around him. We'll get there eventually. There's still plenty here that we didn't check out. Like this warlock party that we weren't invited to. Guarding a chest. Three of them. It does complicate matters. What if we do a quick... Headshot on one. Dis oh, he didn't even die. We disappear back into this because there's another route out. Oh, right, they respawned. Right, because we used our battle flag to level up. It's okay, we'll just quickly kill the few in the front again. Good for our morale rank, if anything. Uh, Archer got us. <laughs> Gotta kill him quick. So got one guy over here. Nice 
nice and easy. Oh, he dropped it down here. Okay. Technically gave us his weapon. Whoa. Another, uh... What is this called? Suan, Suan Yu. It, it's basically the name of what sound they make. Hmm. There's also troops down there? I'm not sure if we want to jump down and just fight this thing right away. Can it even come up here? Like, am I allowed to shoot it and then just shoot it and shoot it? He's only 10 morale rank though, so he's not that scary. If we can kill just the extra troops around him, it should make the fight easier. Well, that guy is rank 8, and he's a... He's a zombie. Anyone else down here that's a zombie? Oh, right. There are other zombies around. Oh, this is bad. Alright, we killed everyone else. I think we said fire should be good against him. Heal, 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 heal. Okay. Let's fight him. Oh, got one more pot, but I guess we can use our Kirin. Land? Can't hit you if we don't land. We should be fine. Okay, maybe not. Is down. And I'm down too. We're back to three morale rank. It's a bit unfortunate. Now he shouldn't be that hard. I think shooting him with arrows mistake. We should have just gone down and fatal attacked him. Hmm. So we don't have to go that way. We can go back to this way. We'll avenge ourselves and get our points back. Not gonna kill him. Alright, we know there's a soldier hiding over here. The three warlocks, which I don't think we can kill with the, our arrows. Um, we can probably get one free kill from the jump and then just fight the other two regular not too bad not too bad detox jerky dispel poison okay Ooh. A four-star mask. Doesn't really suit our build, but definitely a nice item. Can we get up? Guess not. No jumping up from here. Only rank one. Let's just kill him. There are a couple puppies over here. Three of them. They don't see me yet. What's over there? Okay, I think we came from over there. 
these two guys are the ones we want to kill, but we... Oh, there's also one more... Two more above. Okay, so he's got friends. We should be able to get above on him. Yep. If we get up the roof and take out these two first... Wow, rank 9. Someone tried this sneaking route and died. And the problem is rank now, even if we sneak up on him with our current rank, we're not going to kill him. But still a good hit. The warlock see us? No, no. He hasn't, he hasn't, he hasn't. Oh, Sun Yang, come on! Could have executed him. There's a random archer here that we should play kill too. There's a lot of archers here. One more over there. And there's one more patrol- that's not an archer, but that's one more patrolling there. Alright, let's kill this boss first. He has one more lieutenant, a two more lieutenant down here. Hmm, I think we killed this one first. He's only rank one, should be a good headshot candidate. Nope. Did all of them, oh, only, only he's coming. That's perfect. He can't run up the roof. Let me bait the other guy down too. Coming up this side. Oh, we missed that loot. Come on. Alright, let me grab the loot real quick. Arrows. Perfect. He should be alone now. What's his rank? Only three? Ooh. He still has a friend. He still has a friend. Stunned us. I can't see his attack. Okay. He's dead. How kind of you. Alright, there is a loot on that roof, as well as here. How do we get on that roof, though? Hmm. I don't see a path here. <laughs> Can we break these? Yeah, I can't jump. Hmm, that's weird. Maybe in that space over there, there's somewhere to get up on the roof. But we have to get there first. That really a headshot though, it's not giving me the headshot icon.
Right, remember there's a couple guys on the roof here. That's the one piece we're not wearing right now. We'll take a look and see if it's good. If it's good, then we might switch. Toxin attack power. That's actually what we want. Uh, by date obtained, yeah. Because we want the most recent one. Our weight is back to 97.7%. Almost over 100%. If we're over 100, we cannot deflect. So, next point is going to be an Earth. See that shadow? See that bird? A lot of things telling you we're coming up from behind. There's a guy down there. A couple guys down here. Ooh, Battle Axe! It's the first time we've seen this weapon. Surprise, all the commotion didn't alert anyone else. Ooh. Ooh. Right by the door. Drag him over, Sun Jian. Pro Patrol is just like, it's not my problem. It's gonna turn around. It doesn't see us. Ooh, ooh. It's never just the loot. I'll find you a flag soon, Sun Jian. Relax, someone will heal you. That's a flag over there, but how do we get up there is the question. Is it actually a jump that we have to do? Wait, how did he see me? We can kick this down. Flag in there. But I'm more curious about how to get there. Oh, there's a ladder. So that's later. Okay. Is there anyone guarding the sides? Alright, so Dan's healed. I don't think we explored this area enough. Yep. There's easy loot here. Got that ladder down. Now, does that mean we can get back on the roof that we wanted to go later, earlier? All right, because we were thinking about climbing that roof. Yeah, I think we can through this courtyard. 
So he's telling me there's something nearby. I mean, I know this is one thing. Ah, another golden cicada shell. Is he alerting us to something else, perhaps? Maybe in this cave that looks really dangerous. Oh, that's new. It's a flaming porcupine. Okay, we damage it pretty hard. Just kill it. Ooh, he explodes. Did we... Yeah, we have not used this route. We're gonna go in that cave again. Just wanna make sure... We got everything leading up to it. Let's see what attacked us. Trig white. Water ghost. Huoshu. Fire rats. Okay. Qinglong. The divine beast. That we got from Guan Yu. We get the second lines for each. We're meeting Cao Cao. Sun Jian. Zhang Bao has his third line, so I guess we kill them. Bo Cai. And Huang Fu Song. Ooh, another one. Could we do invisibility? Fire. Oh no, he doesn't explode. Okay. This is a different area. We're trying to find... Ooh. I think over there. Right there, yeah, we died too, so you over there. But there's also... A demonized Changui over here. And we got demons everywhere. I'm not going down. Rank 3 leather. Okay. This is where we died. There's a couple of zombies on the ground as well that we should kill beforehand. We showed up over there last time. Can we not get a headshot? That is his head, isn't it? Oops. Oh, no. Oh, we cannot get back up. That is great. Oh, thank God. Will the big bird please calm down? We'll approach it later. When it does calm down. Wait, did we come through this one? We did, right? That's where we fought the Huoshu. Yes, indeed. Okay. How do we miss the loot, though? I guess the same can be answered here. How do we miss this loot? I think the bird has uh, chilled. Yep. All right, one zombie down, but there's more down there. First, let's kill him. Headshot. Didn't kill him, but second headshot did. 
There's more. I'm gonna find the other zombies first. And we're gonna try to get a fatal attack on him. Don't see any other zombies. Ooh, tier three bamboo crossbow. Toxin attack power, awesome. Sneaking up on Big Bird's not going to be easy, but uh, I think it's doable. Doesn't patrol that far. I can jump down. Get a decent jump on it. Wait, after it turns. I'm going to wait for one more cycle. I want to get behind him first. I, I don't think there are any other zombies out here. Maybe we can. Oh, I should switch weapons too. Get serious with him. All right, he turns here, and then we we make a go for it. Heal, heal, heal. We got this. The toxin's working its thing. There we go. And that weapon difference is pretty massive. Okay, feels like there's nothing here aside from the bird. Don't think we can go up there. Or can we? No. Now, previously we came through this route, so I'm curious if we missed something this time because we didn't come through this route. Yeah, there's a warlock. We got the flag. There is that general with the... Let's see. We're just gonna rush him. Yeah, that's a path that I think we took last time. Got a banner here. Right, so I don't think we missed anything. We can kill that guy just for a little bit extra morale rank. And then head back out. Archer. Okay, we're strong enough to just clear this out. Especially with this weapon. The same one that he has. Ooh, Chivalrous Swordsman Dual Sword. That sounds like something the OP would use. Uh, let's see. It's not part of any set. Okay. So it's not technically no base gear, I'm assuming. We did lose a loot here. Ooh, five mineral powder. We can do drugs now. Okay, we're supposed to move up from here? No. I know we jumped down. Where did we jump down from? Oh, we can't get back out. 
from down here. Does the door open from this side? Yeah, it does. Okay, that makes sense. Zombies! You want to charge me? I don't want to charge you. Uh, okay, Sun Jian wants to charge you. Because I don't want to activate the other zombies around. There's a bunch of them. Oh, he's turning around. Why oh, can't I just... Let me just climb up. Let me just climb up. Let me grab this. Oh, Sun Jian can't help himself. There's a Chungui down here, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Right there. It's glowing red, so there's a Warlock boosting it. And uh, of course we want to kill that Warlock first. How do we get up on that tower? I guess we get through there. Okay. Oh no! Oh! We would have missed this chest. Ooh, finally a two-star ring pummel blade, a saber. Been looking for one of those. We only had a tier one. All right, we want to get up there, but I don't think we have time for that. What's he laughing at? Yeah, there's a there's a tiger that he can hunt, Mr. Tiger of Jeongdong. Let him pass. Let him pass. We climb. Ooh. Oh. Oh. He stunned us. We couldn't lock onto him. Alright, we're not jumping him yet. We're gonna kill the warlock first. I want that loot. Can we make this jump? Yes, we can. Uh, getting back is a whole nother issue. We've gotta go around again. All right, good timing on the Chongui. That's the guy. That's the guy we have to kill right there. <coughs> Gotta use that ladder. So I guess we make this jump first. Another battle axe user over there. Oh, they got another Chungwei over here. They got a pair. I want to access that flag, but let's clear the first tiger. Oh, there's another warlock on that side. I don't think we have access to that one. Guess we will have to snipe him. And it's tiger killing time. There's a. Uh, looks like a Horshu over there. Yep. I'm gonna wait till the tiger comes back to right under this bridge. Oh, there's another Horshu over there. Sneaky. That's not a headshot. Then I guess I'll wait till he gets over here, farther away from those things. Ah, uh, four attack. Oh, he did six attacks. Somehow remember it was four. Now it's six. Okay, okay. Ooh. 
<laughs> Still dead. No problem. I remember it was four slashes in a row. Well, it did four parries and still got pretty damaged there. All right, we got, ooh, demonized officer too. What is going on here? We didn't really explore this field, although I don't think there is much loot here. There's another Hoshu over here, which I think it's safer to remove from above. Or at least some sort of sneak. So I guess we can do this as well. Is that guy gonna come over? Turn? Turn? Oh, he sees us. We hit our morale rank 25 pretty naturally this time. Gonna make that jump. Get that marking flag down. So 10 jumps down, it's like, you're climbing back up again? Yep. Ooh, he didn't get killed. In one hit. There's a chest, but there's also this guy. Ooh, oh wait, that's Sun Jian. How did he get... He freaked me out. We got ourselves a flag here, but there's a Chongwei down there, and there's a lot of enemies around. Demonized officers as well. We're gonna kill everything and then pick up that flag. He has that jump. That's part of his path. Archer. We should get some arrow back from him, so killing him with one doesn't hurt us. We only have five left. They usually drop arrows. Yep. Dragon Cure Powder. Restore health over time. Okay. We're starting to move. Uh, both of your warlords, let's stop pretending. Given the chance, you would both betray the Han. Alright, we get it. We get a jump on him. Uh, Sun Jian and Cao Cao never gets to fight each other. He has friends. First grab this. And then we jump the big guy down here. You're dead. Uh, so did you have trouble with that ladder there? Couldn't come down for the fight earlier. All right, the Chongwei doesn't move, so we have to take this chance to first kill everything else around it first.
There's another soldier walking around. Wait. We can't access this? Oh! <laughs> In our face. Okay, now I think we just have to get high and jump down on the Chongui. Or sneak right behind it. Oh, he has another soldier walking in front of him. Hmm. Maybe we can snipe him? Kind of hard. The angle, I can't pin the arrow down anymore. That's the limit. Not picking up a shot. That's headshot, so it's not going to kill him. Uh, I don't think we can fight them separately. I don't want to fight. Well, I want... Ooh. What happened to this guy? I want to fight them separately, but I don't know if we can. Now, I understand the map is a little bit more vertical, but uh, you're nothing compared to Guan Yu and Zhang Fei, who uh, has been much bigger help. Sun Jian has a habit of showing up slightly late. That guy's just slow. No headshot in the. Oh, it's very brief. Very brief. All right, I'm gonna have him come over and chase us. Oh no no no! Not you! Not you! You'll reset. Missed the jump. Alright, he reset. What about the other guy? We get a headshot from this angle. Stop moving your head. Alright, it's just him. It's just him. It's just him. This is good. Alright, now the coast is clear. Um. How do we get up again? All right, buddy. Protect our rank. Jump. And killed. Alrighty, so with this flag grabbed, next room filled with more zombies, we're gonna end our episode here. We're gonna come back. We have to cross from above, I think, and we're gonna advance against the Yellow Turban's position here in Guangzhou. Maybe a mini boss coming up, and we'll see how we deal with that. We're ready, morale ring 25, so it shouldn't be too difficult. So, see you guys then. Bye!